striker power problem uncovered in test of U.S. Army network gear. The U.S. Army said it identified a power problem potentially associated with new communications and network tools and striker combat vehicles during a live fire exercise in Europe. Soldiers with the 3rd Squadron, 2nd Cavalry Regiment put Capability Set 23 equipment to the test in recent weeks at Grafenwohr Training Area in Germany, as officials from the Army's Network Modernization Office and Test and Evaluation Command looked on. One issue identified during the exercise was related to power, or lack thereof. The striker soldiers relied upon were power constrained during the event, hamstringing what could be accomplished in the field. Questions lingered about whether it was the newly fitted kit, the integrated tactical network, or the striker variant itself that sat at the root of the problem. The unit was saying they were having some issues with not being able to do silent watch for an extended duration where, basically, the strikers shut off and run on batteries while they're doing night operations, Lt. Col. Jonathan Judy, a product manager for Capability Set Development, told reporters on a conference call. They were having some difficulties there. That's one of the things we took back. We're going to see if it's ITN equipment on there that's giving them some issues, he said, or if it's the type of striker they have. Officials said the matter is under investigation and will be remediated, and that a solution may already exist with newer versions of the combat vehicle. The Army Program Executive Office for Ground Combat Systems, which works with strikers, is looped in. The Army is taking a stepwise approach to upgrade soldier communications and the grander network, the invisible threads that tie together and inform assets on the battlefield. The increments are known as capability sets, a meshing of off-the-shelf products and specialized military tech.